All right, guys. Welcome back to some McGrathy plays. We are dicking around again in some Warhammer Total War 3. We're on turn number four. Uh, I read a little bit of stuff on the internet uh, yesterday. Uh, I guess I read about um, the compass here a little bit. Uh, and we also have another... Uh, we have another thing that we have to pay attention to. Where is it? The control. But there's another, there was the, um, I don't know. There was something else that we were supposed to be watching. Diplomacy, technology, ivory road, compass. Uh, there was another one um, that I wanted to keep neutral, but uh, I didn't do that. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, we are going to continue up, and we're going to find out uh, what we want to, to basically do. Uh, so the world events that happened, that's great. We have a seal the gate and the taunting of Qian Qi. So we have to seal this gate here. So you'll get capture and occupy the following settlement, treasury, and we get a biting blade. All right, that sounds good. We could do that. Where is my dudes? Where are my dudes? There they are. This we got, uh, so we can start moving her. Uh, we have to... What's this? Uh, it looks like a relay race or something. Not sure what that is, but uh, yeah, we need to we need to go. How come we can't move? I guess we're our turn is over, maybe. So that's fine. Let's uh, yeah, let's change the turn. And let's see what we can do next. Yeah, 129 factions left, or. Cities or heroes? I think it might be heroes. Uh, Stormwind capture and following the yeah the, the gate. That's what we're doing, and we got the Fletching Mentors. That's great. Um, come on, keep moving, please. As far as we could go there, uh, we have a technology tree. So we did. We got this already. Uh, we got the hardened bamboo. What's the next range thing that we're gonna get? Doesn't look like much. Growth and income. This makes our guys a little better. Dragon scales. I mean, armor is pretty nice. Recruitment rank and leadership for spearmen. I mean, that's always good too, right? I wish I had more things for the fletching mentors or for the uh, ranged units though, because that's. Um, Really kind of what we want, right? Oh, there's a bunch of stuff here. Oh, this is actually a pretty big tree. Okay, so I guess we need to get to this eventually. So we probably want to work on... Yeah, doing some stuff. Corruption is minus one, and then income from industry. <coughs> from industry buildings. I think going economy is not that bad i think that's probably fine we have a research rate of 112 percent so that's good uh let's see i don't, I don't think we can get there yet yeah we, we can't quite get there yet <clears throat> snake gate yeah i need to get to the snake gate uh what else do we have to do pretty much nothing we've built what we need to build. Uh, oh, we can recruit some more stuff. Uh, we have two hail gunners already. We don't have any cavalry. So let's make three cavalry. And let's end the turn. I didn't uh, make cavalry, I think, or I didn't make any warriors the last time. We want to be careful we don't go through too much of our gold recruiting. Um, but we do, we do need a pretty strong army, so I'm okay doing that. 
three turns left for the technology that we're doing. An old woman, garbed in peasant robes, beckons you over with a gnarled finger, never breaking eye contact. She presses something into your hands, then bows and walks away. You may discard. You make to discard the surely worthless trinket, then notice the silver moon inscribed upon it, the mark of the empress. Passive ability, gleaming pendant. Leadership, plus four. I mean, all right. I guess we can take that. Who did I... Uh, did I put that on my character? How do I... Character details. I haven't done that yet. Quicksilver armor. Let's put that on. Feather for a token. No, we don't want that. Scroll of leeching. That's obviously on her. Oops. So this is... Uh, Hex of the Winds. Power recharge minus 40%. Affects enemies in range. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, that's a nice little ability, I guess. Uh, an enchanted item. Uh, Iron Curse Icon. Okay, that's sitting on this guy. So that's okay. And Missile Resistance. Yeah, I think that's perfectly fine. Take that out. Um, do we want... Let's see, this is... Upkeep is 2314. Mm. Yeah. We can probably get some more. Uh, we have two of these. We have Celestial Dragon Guards. I can't make those, though. Hmm. Global recruitment is only available whilst garrisoned or in the in camp stance. Can I go in camp? Situation. Stance channeling. In camp. Enables replenishment. Camp movement range penalty 50%. Okay, so if we go like that. Gunpowder road. Oh, I see. So this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, so we can build basically more units, but we'd have to uh, build them at home. So that's fine. Uh, I'm. Can I go back to my regular stance? I guess I have to wait now, right? Ambush. Oh, this is pretty good. Okay, really sorry about that. Hopefully I go back and edit that out of the video, but I had someone, um, one of my employees calling me and I wanted to make sure I took care of that. 
Uh, so we have, uh, let's see, who should we get? Just some backup I think is good. Um, let's get just one of these as well. Yeah, I think this is fine. So I can recruit from somewhere else and they will go to my army, I guess. I hope so. It sounds pretty good. Their demands. Wait, Zhao Ming, the Iron Dragon. Wait, aren't, isn't that my dudes? That's my own dudes. That's the, the Grand Cathay dudes already. Right? Why is he why is he demanding? Stuff. Why is he demanding stuff on me? Oh, he's actually got more power than me. Uh, so he wants to get payment? I will counter offer no payments. And a... What's military access? Trespassing, okay. Yeah, this is what I'm going to do. Threaten, balance offer. Tariffs, income. Okay, so how do I... Done. Declare war, join war, payments. Break trade agreement. Balance offer, threaten. No, that's not what I want. Uh... I don't really want any of these. I'm going to exit. Go screw yourself, buddy. I'm not interested in getting getting wrecked by you. Okay. Oh, I see. These are They're all doing their stuff. Cool, no problem at all. Alright, can I in unsettled times it pays to maintain harmony amongst the competing forces of nature? How do I unencamp these? Strive for balance. Oh yeah, this is the harmony thing. So I need to keep my harmony balanced. Uh, which I actually don't know how to do. Scroll of leeching. Movement range zero. Wait, I want to move some. Campaign movement disabled when recruiting. Oh, I see. That sucks. Uh, learn more harmony. Cathay and Freck factions choose to be choose to maintain stability between the forces of yin and yang and focus on either uh, or focus on either opposed principle. Both balance and imbalance have their own rewards. Many buildings are either yin or yang aligned. The harmony level and breakdown of yin and yang. Uh, lotus indicator. Each leaf of the lotus indicator. Where is the lotus indicator? Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. Battle. Okay, so some units and some buildings are, are are aligned. I don't know where that is, but that's fun. Dispatch a caravan along the Ivory Road. Alright. Okay, let's do it. Let's do this guy. We'll recruit this guy. And we want to caravan you off to uh, where, where do you want to go I guess we'll just go the shortest route right destination so cargo value a thousand But then what do we what do we get? Does it tell us what we get as well? I don't know. We'll figure it out. We got seven fifty for doing that, so that's fine. I'm happy with that. Okay, so now we can change it maybe. Oh, we can't do anything while we're still recruiting. Okay, so we're still recruiting. We, we got one more t turn for these guys. Um, I, I guess that's fine. Oh yeah, yeah. Here it says two turns on these ones, the global ones. So that's fine. Uh, these show our uh, quest indicators, so that's great. This technology is done. Good. Nothing else to do. We know because this is um, it's set to turn, and it doesn't give us something that we want to do. Population surplus province gunpowder roll. The population service may now be spent by upgrading main settlement building. Oh, great! That's awesome. 
in the gunpowder thing. Uh, caravan encounter, hungry, hungry ogres. Uh, yeah, how does it say? Uh, diplomatic relations plus 40 with blood guzzlers. Ah, uh, they'll let you pass if they can eat some of your meat. Oh my god, so do we let them eat the peasant long spearmen? Oh, well, that's gross. That's gross. Let's do it. Feeding time. See ya. See ya. Sorry, spearmen. You were well... Well cooked. Okay, now we can actually move. So, raiding. We have a penalty of 50%. Income control is minus 5 in the raided process. Immune to most attrition. Well, why would we... Raids wealth from the local region. Oh, well, we don't want to do that because this is our region. Winds of magic. Ambush. Hidden until discovered or battle initiated. Okay. And March. So this makes us move faster, but recruitment is disabled. So I think we just choose stance none, which lets us uh, basically go to where we want. Oh, wait, why is this guy over here? Let's go mess this guy up, huh? Let's go wreck his face-sickles. Global recruitment, and here at Gunpowder Road, we can get. Uh, let's get some more melee guys. Let's do both of those. All right, what else can we do? Uh, we can, yeah, we can upgrade our fort. Oh no, the main building we can't upgrade. Okay. What can we upgrade? It? Oh, the mines. Okay, the mines can be upgraded. So we upgrade that. And I think that's it. Oh, yes, yeah, see, I can see these indicators now. So they are like yin and yang. That's why I can't build some of these other ones, right? Merchant caravans, gem, uh, gem caravans, gem factors, okay. Uh, we can build that. Can't do that quite yet. Can't do this quite yet. I think the only other thing we could do is this. So let's build one of those. That takes two turns. So we're pretty much ready to go. Now we should be able to finish our research on our uh, economic research thing we were doing a while ago. Okay, I don't know what that means. Uh, that demands military access and you offer military access. Um, let's counter offer. I want you guys to give me money to manage payment. I want 901 gold to do that. Does that offer it to them or not? I just exited. I guess that just, I don't know where it says. Uh, the UI is not very friendly, apparently. Enemies, enemies everywhere. Okay, fair enough. All right, technology, let's move on. The Grace of Qiyan, uh, Kui Yin, the Moon Empress, uh, grants Banner of the Moon Empress to your faction. This is minus 10% for Yin units. So the following units receive bonus. Okay, so a bunch of our archers looks pretty good. Uh, harmonic Mastery, true balance requires the trust and participation of all souls, only when we think and work. So that's just income from cities. Okay, I did say I wanted to go a little bit quicker through this um, playthrough than I did on the last one. So I will uh, probably do that. Uh, did my did that dude run away? Where did he go? No, he's over here. He's running just slightly further than we can. Oh, he's in March March mode. Okay, that's fair. I am going to probably go here. Can I go over here? How come I can't move? How come I can't move? I can move. There we go.
Oh, can I not make it? I'm like just off of that. Okay, sounds good. My treasury is good. Predicted income. Background income. Building income total. And army keep 28 minus 3. So I'm still getting good income. This is our positive, even though we have a big army. That's, uh, that's good. We're going to end this turn. And we're going to take this snake gate next. 123 factions or 123 lords, I guess, still still in service. Tianjiang Caravan. Uh, your guides know of a route less traveled that is safer and quicker, but such precious information will not be cheap to obtain. A small share of the caravan's profits will no doubt ease their tongues. Uh, all right, a little bit, uh, that's fine. Okay, none, yeah, that's fine. Here I've recruited at Nangao, an alchemist. All right, sounds good. Yeah. All right then. Sounds good. Uh, I don't want to be going there. I want to take this and I want to uh, snake gate. Capture and occupy the following settlement. Yeah, that's that's what I'm doing. Can how is there right? There we go. Colonize. This gives me uh, turns remaining. Having recently colonized a ruin, this army is vulnerable. Oh. Okay, well that's fine. We will colonize it. We get Lei Fan to level 4. Uh, follower gained. The Fu Hung Monk. Alright. Uh, Stormwind Coronal, a gift from her father, Coronal, is said to be a locus, allowing Meow to wield the storm winds with ease. Okay. Sign a non aggression pact with any faction. Well, I could probably do that. Let's see. No, that's the compass. I'm looking for the faction list. Where's the faction list? Somewhere up here, right? Uh, events, provinces, known factions. There we go. Who, we sh who should we do a non aggression pact with? Oh, this guy. We're at war with him? Why are we at war with him? Uh, let's sign a non-aggression pact with this guy. How can we how can we do that? Where's our diplomacy? This is diplomacy, right? Yeah. Uh, Imperial Wardens. Let's initiate a non-aggression pact. Non-aggression pact. Trade settlement, declare war. Propose offer. They have accepted. Great. Sounds good, buddy. Thank you very much, my friend. We got 500 bucks for that. And we got a biting blade for getting the snake gate. And some other stuff. And some other stuff. And some other stuff. There's a lot of crap that happens when you're playing this game, I guess. Uh, so, let's just continue the taunting of Qian Chi. Uh, where did that guy go? That, that other dude ran away, hey? Okay, that's fine. All things in balance. Construct three buildings that contribute to harmony. Yeah, where's our harmony uh, thing here? Scouting, recently colonized. Does it show in character details? It should so show somewhere else, right? Uh, this is going to be skills. We have an extra point here. You can see because of this little uh, plus there. Uh, so what should he get? A steel technology. Research rate is up. Control is modified up, uh, or magic item drop chance. I, I like the magic item drop chance, to be honest. We keep getting items is uh, good for us. Um, let's go to details. What do we have here? Biting blade. Weapon. Ooh, yeah, this is good. 
We only have one weapon. Gleaming Pendant. Leadership 4. Oh yeah, we want to put that on, don't we? Ancillaries. Uh, okay, can't we put those here? Uh, Gleaming Pendant, I think, is really good. Seduce Units. Corruption. I, I, I want this guy, though. Oh, there's two Swordmasters. That's pretty cool. Um, oh, I want the Gleaming Pendant. How can I put that on? I want to put that on. Oh, do I just go like this? Salvage? No. Oh, I, I can only... Who can't I... Lord. Oh, yeah, that's fine. I, I do want this here. I need to go to me. Meow Yang. There we go. Gleaming Pigment. I want that here. Jade Sculptor is good. Uh, and then a Sword Master. Can I put that down? No, I can't. That's fine. All right, we're done with this. Lots of things to do, man. This is this is why this game is so complicated. There's so much to do. Um, so you Q. UQ. Let's bring you up here, UQ. You are a an alchemist. So, let's bind you to one of my other uh Sourthel the Everwatcher. Terracotta graveyard. Is that uh it's not us. There's a dude there. Is this what we have to take? Yeah, we have to we have to we have to take that. So let's uh, start heading that way. Okay, we'll leave there. I think we have to construct some stuff here. Uh, snake gate. Oh, we need to repair. No, we need to do that. Okay. That's fine. Can we do anything here? Gunpowder Road. Uh, yes, we can build the gem factors. I thought we did that already, though. Didn't we do that already? I feel like we already had that going, but for some reason it did not. Um, resolve or skip this? Oh, commandment is available. Oh, I see. Yeah, commandment on this this province or this... Uh, the city you are going to be a casualty no unis unis experience per turn is 200 that's pretty cool um yeah let's do this um because i think your province is western great bastion okay so that's all these guys here that, that's in here this is the western great bastion here so while my units are in there, they get 200 extra experience. That's uh, that's pretty cool. That's nice. We'll we'll take it. Uh, and then we end the turn. I hope you guys are enjoying this series, by the way. Um, it's just the second video, obviously. Um, I actually I was going to wait. Uh, through me, you have the celestial Lester favor. Okay, you are going to pay me in order to have a trade agreement. Um. All right, that sounds good. That sounds good. I'll take it. Uh, we have 121. Oh, we lost some lords. Apparently, two people died. Uh, caravan's journey. Nice. Maintain control of three provinces. Okay. Character rank and skills. Yeah, I understand that. Magic items. Yeah, I understand that. Caravan completed. Sold its wares in Frozen Landing for thirty-seven forty. It will now begin returning to the capital. Uh, the demand for trade goods in Frozen Landing is reduced. Now, don't think are they going to pick up stuff from there or no? Uh, caravan completed. Unique item. Tian Zhang. Uh, a frost worm skull. Vanguard deployment. Outside the deployment zone. Oh, nice. Frost Worm Skull. Okay. 
That's pretty cool. And armor gains. Great Bastion attack imminent. The Great Bastion threat level has increased. Chaos gathers. An attack is imminent. Uh, uh, is that at the Snake Gate then? Turtle Gate. That's the Dragon Gate. Where's the Turtle Gate? Is there a Turtle Gate? Is Turtle Gate somewhere else? Uh, let's see if we can go to it. Oh, it's up there. Well, we're we're not part of that, so I guess that'll just be fine. I guess that'll just be okay. All right, we need to do some stuff. Tactician, reload skill, and melee defense. I mean, it's okay, I guess. This is Tian Zhang, the caravan master. Hard to hit, inspiring presence. Cost of caravan shortcut is 10%. Chance of caravan intercept being an ambush. Uh, attrition. Better scales. Cargo capacity. I think... I think this is pretty good. We'll take this one here. Uh, and we want to... We can't recruit units for it. We have to wait, I guess. Maybe we can do it once they get home or something. This guy is... Who's this? This is Kairos Fate Weaver in March stance. All right, cool. Um, we need to move my dudes. Move them to here. We need to move him, them to here. Uh, can we can we merge these armies? Uh, can I take her? Uh, embed hero. Yeah. So let's let's do that then. Let's embed the hero. Who should we get rid of? Let's get rid of like one of these spearmen. Just disband them. Yeah, let's disband that. And then... Yeah, increase the mobility of our army. That sounds pretty good. We, we need to take that, right? Yeah, declare war. Let's do it. Let's take this crap out. Yep. Yeah, bring it. Bring it, buddy. Oh, is this the guy there? He's like, he's got like two dudes. Sounds like you're, sounds like you're screwed, buddy. Do we not, are we not close enough? Is that it? Okay. Can we put ourselves in a different stance? No, I don't want to do that. War. Okay, that's fine. I guess we're under war now. This guy's going to run back to his base, but he's like, he's two guys. He's, yeah, he's not going to win that one. Hmm. An ambush. Uh, auto resolve. We don't what we don't know what he actually has. I'm gonna just auto resolve this. Valiant defeat. Oh my god, we died. Wait, what? We deployed. Oh, he deployed 1700. What the crap? Ambushes. An army may lie in wait for its enemies by entering an ambush stance. It wait. It would remain hidden until until they wander up to the trap. Beastmen and Skaven armies can proactively ambush enemy armies while attacking in certain stances. Okay, we learned something new. That sounds horrendous. Uh, so now what? We just have no army? Did we just lose the game? Uh, uh, close victory. Wait, who's this guy? Kurgan Warband. Yeah, let's do that too. Auto on that one. Unit experience. We want army replenishment. Assistance is available, should you need it, my lord. 
you may rely upon. Yeah, we we faction destroyed. Okay. Kurgan Warband. Uh, killed in battle, Lee Fan. Killed in battle, UQ. Enemy killed in battle. Enemy killed in battle. Wounded. Must take time to recover. Okay. Potion of healing. All right. Well. <laughs> okay. So let's uh, see what we can do here. We want some more better units. What can we do? We can do this. We'll do that. Hey, okay, here we go. Advanced military. Basic military. You must first upgrade your main settlement chain building. You need two population surplus. Okay, so we can't do that then. But we can get the Nangao Forge. I think we already have the access to that, though, from our other settlement. Uh, Where's Market... Tea parter, parlor. Um, I think we took the conscription field in the other one, right? Didn't we? Nan Lee. Okay, we need. We can. We can upgrade this. So that's pretty good. Uh, building upgrade available. We can make a stockades or lookouts. Plague Immunity, Stockades, Defensive Spells. I wish we could start this, but we must upgrade the settlement first. We just don't have enough to do that. Um, I think I might build... Uh, I think we took this one on the other one, so I think we'll take this one here. Okay. Okay. All things are in balance. Oh man, that sucked getting our whole army destroyed. That's uh, it's pretty bad. Maybe I shouldn't have auto battled it, but like they had seventeen hundred power or men or units or whatever it was to our eleven hundred. So I feel like that wasn't very great. The Moon Empress sets her own conventions. Chief from among least ability to pass without being noticed whenever she chooses. Okay. Okay. Uh, steel technology success. Uh, this is Mech Elgerson Ingerson. Uh, banner gained. Can move hidden in any terrain. Uh, the Moon Empress. That's okay. So, how do we use that though? Great Bastion. The bar, the wall, okay, the people beyond the walls attack. All right, so what can we do then? The compass, the celestial lake is full. Okay. The great bastion now. We can move over to there. That's fine. We need uh, recruitment. <laughs> we need some, we need some recruitment because we just lost everything. Uh, that is being researched. Uh, let's build this as well. We need the dormitory, but we can't quite build that. Uh, what's this? The caravan needs to go to... Let's go to here. And we will bump this up. And we'll dispatch that. Okay. Dispatched our caravans. Did all of our stuff. We just have to recruit some more stuff when I guess we're we have some more units. Uh, okay. Their demands. Uh, why don't you just pick a big bag of D's? And why don't you do what your mother does? Hundred and nine heroes. I guess two of those were ours, right? Is this guy trying to kill our buildings now? Uh, raise or sack the following settlements. Okay, I need to get my... Uh, I need to get 
my hero. Where's my hero again? She's she's still dead. Do I not have any hero right now? Can I recruit a hero? Recruit Lord. Here we go. Uh, legendary Lords. They will be available for recruitment in one turn. Okay. Dragon Blood Shurgan Lord. Ooh. Lord of Yin, Lord of Yang. Lord Magistrate. Uh. Yang. How do I know where my yin or yang is? I'm gonna I'm gonna take I'm gonna take this lord. And I can't I can't get the renown. I'll get one of each of these though. And I will make Oh settlement building first. Okay, well, what do I need for this? One population surplus. Okay, so let's get some population surplus. How do we get bigger population? Recruitment cost, recruit rank. Defensive supplies. Growth plus 20. Let's take that. I think that will give us more population, won't it? All right, we should be ready to go now. Mm, no allies. Declare all oracles of... All right. Opportunity to intercept. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Let's auto resolve that. <clears throat> Execute, venerate, or pardon. Let's venerate. You are some dudes of mine, friendzos. Uh, and now the turns keep going. 106 lords left, and everyone's dropping like flies. I think we started with like 130 something. Uh, opportunity to intercept. Oh my god, what? We just. Uh. Dude, how. We got one dude. We don't we get we had two of these in one turn? This seems ridiculous. Okay, we're gonna get defeated there. That's fine. <clears throat> ambushers. Oh my god. Fight the ambushers. Victory. Just die. Alright, we're just auto resolving a lot of this stuff because uh, Yeah, we, we just want to. We don't have a huge army there, so I'll just take that. Uh, XP. Flesh greeters have been obliterated. Yep, our, our new dude that we just paid for, uh, Snake Gate, was raised. <coughs> uh huh. Elizabeth! Oh, my daughter's up and ready to roll. Mission issued. Okay, there is so much going on here, it's uh, kind of crazy. So, where's my, where's my dude? Where's, where's my... Where's my, where's my dude? Do I have to recruit her again? No, nope, I don't want that. I want... Uh, I don't want this. Where's my other... Where's my dudes? Uh, where are we? Here we go. Recruit Lord. Yes, that's that's who we want. And we would like... Oh, we can't recruit another one. Okay. That's fine. And we can't get the regiments of, regiments of renown yet. So that's fine. Uh, we will get one of these and one of these. Uh, seems good. And we will... Are we already... Yeah. Mustering. Yeah, we're mustering, so that's what we're doing. Okay, we have Tenzin Caravan Master. Is uh, We've got Wayfinders now. Uh, we can't get the next one till 4. Uh, 
But we're going to go for the hidden stores as well. Just keep our army a little bit more uh, alive. And then now we go into the next turn. This is going to be a very short game here. You can pause this game by pressing this button. Okay, got it. I don't want to pause it. I want it, you to keep going, please. Play. I see it. It paused it for me. I, I don't want to do that, though. Okay. Uh, nothing. Their demands. Uh, okay, we accept that. We need to not make as many enemies as we have right now. Uh, these guys keep going. And there we go. Keep the established route. Let's just keep up. Okay, let's go back to here. Who is this guy? This is just one guy. Why do we have... Shaman Sorcerer. <clears throat> okay. Get a new army, that basically said. Yeah, I'd love to do that. Wouldn't that be fun? So if we recruit a new lord... Uh, enlightened bureaucrat, strategist, tactician. Yep. Let's do that. Okay. And then let's recruit some dudes. Recruit those dudes, please. Okay. Now. So we have these guys. Why can I not... I can't fight the dude that's right here. I, he's, he's, he's right there. I, I wish... I wish to fight him. He's like right in my base, killing my dudes. Second front. Okay. The winds of magic blow across the land, providing a source of magical power. Uh, they can store this power used for their spell casting. All right, that's fine. That's cool. Uh, we are doing this, Meow Yang, yes. Yep, okay, you got that. So, reward is 1,000 for that, that's great. Now let's go back to here. How come we can't attack this dude? Uh, how come we can't? I don't understand. I don't understand why we can't kill this guy that's like in our base. Hmm? Why we can't attack this guy? Not that I would win with this, probably, but you know, whatever. Uh, we need to build something here. Good, we can get the dormitory. Jade Warrior Crossbowman, that's really nice. Uh, here we can build something as well. We can't quite build those. The mines will get one of these. Sure, why not? Nothing else that's making us do, so let's end the turn. Yeah, this game is uh, one of those frustrating things. Like, I don't know why it doesn't let me attack that dude. The dude's, like, in my territory. Is he, is he like, just chilling there? Do I not get to attack him? Oh my gosh. Ambushers. Okay, let's fight. Valiant defeat. I don't know. This is all on normal and we're just getting wrecked, right? Besieging Nangao in gunpowder. Okay. Alright, all of these things are going on. Just like 50,000 things. What's this guy? Pinch Eye. Go kill this guy. Yeah, he's he's in my he's in my dudes. Right? So is this guy. You are attacking the Kurgan warband. Yeah. 
I, of course, they're in my dudes. I'm gonna get experience. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, Kurgan Warband is dead. Great brush and threat reduced. Good. Who is this guy? Uh, Pinch Eye. All right, let's bring this guy a little closer, maybe. Can you see more about him now? Yeah, declare war. Yeah, okay. Do it. Close victory. Bring it, buddy. Yeah. Get out of my base. Stop killing my dudes. The Glothal Brood have been obliterated. All right, then. All right, then. Let's uh, recruit some more dudes, right? Let's uh, recruit some of these guys. And uh, let's go recruit some uh, global dudes. Let's see. What do we need? It take two turns, though. I don't really want that. Okay, I've got three of those already at Gunpowder Road. Uh, I think we want one of these, one of these. One of these. Okay, training facilities are, yeah, okay, well, fair enough. Uh, Miao Ying, we leveled up. Inspiring presence, unyielding, sure aim, eastern fires, uh, sky fire. Um, route marcher. This could be pretty good. Sometimes I need that extra little bit of of movement speed, so we'll we'll do that. We're just building up our army now again because we got uh, wrecked so hard. So let's just build up this army. I like having two armies so that I can recruit twice. It's pretty nice. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no. Uh, payments, 7,000. No, I'm going to decline. I'm going to tell you to go pound dirt and eat a dick. Not interested. Okay, stances. Dissenter Lords of Jinjin. Okay, technology researched. Great. Uh, Quoth the Raven. All right, sounds good. Let's go back into technology here. Harmonic Mastery. Income. Bureaucratic Training is Growth and Income. Jade Stance. Uh, bigger. Uh, makes our front line quite a bit better. I think uh, we can work on this because, um, yeah, obviously our our army was uh, totally wrecked. Uh, let's get this guy. Let's recruit some units. Let's recruit recruit uh, two of those and three of the uh, two of those and one of those. That's great. I mean, yeah, let's recruit some more units. Oh, we got we got all of those. Okay, that's fine. Resolve. Can we upgrade a unit? No, we can do this though. Control, recruit rank and harmony. Okay, that's fine. Uh, yeah, I guess we end the turn. We're going to do probably a couple more turns and then we'll call that a day. Let's see what else we can do here. There's 97 lords left. Uh, it seems like they're going pretty quick. Going pretty quick. Yeah, okay. Nope, decline. Not interested in giving you guys money for absolutely no reason. Doesn't seem like that works for me. <clears throat> Disciplinarian. Yes. Okay, control one treasury 750 if I get that. Okay. Armory built. Good. Uh, let's recruit. Um... We want probably cavalry as well. Although maybe we want uh, Jade Warrior Crossbowman. That's probably what we want there, right? Yep. And then here. Gunpowder Road is already being used. Okay, well, I guess we'll use this global one for that then. And we'll end our turn. An army almost is created. Okay. Uh, 
they are much stronger than us, uh, but we do not accept that. You can go away, buddy. We're not giving you money. Aren't you Grand Cathay too? Aren't you like a, a friendly dude? Why are you trying to... Wreck? Oh, what's this? 92 left. Yeah, see, this is the thing. I'm not doing much for all these turns, but I think those guys are... Um, those guys are getting a little bit more... Yeah, they are getting a little bit uh, stronger, so... Yeah, we'll put that in the army. Why not? Uh, who are we doing now? We've got three of these coming into the thing. Gunpowder Road. I feel like we need... Like two more of these and one of these. We just need some more front line, basically. Sons of the Mountain faction is destroyed. Hero recruited. Okay, those are the recruiting options. Uh, we've got two more turns on that. This guy's already uh, done his thing. So we can garrison there. Unit exchange. Let's see. I'm going to exchange this for this. And this for this. I want my main character to have the strongest uh, army. I'm going to put this in here. And actually, I'm going to put these in here as well. I'm going to give this guy a lot of bunch of stuff, basically. There we go. Recruiting is done. All right, last turn here until we give it up. 56 minutes into this game, so yeah, we're we're doing one more hour here. I mean, again, I we died, which sucks. Uh, so maybe this is just like kind of a lost thing. Um, we're going to decline all of these. I, I, I don't know. We're, we're in a bad position and I don't want to give up money for no reason. Uh, the Box of Delights. A wild eye alchemist probably presents you with an ornate chest which seems to vac vacillate in and out of corp corporeality. He declares that it contains the purest magic distilled from several tons of warp stone and purges, purged of all corruption. His experiment, alas, is unrepeatable so this boon must be used wisely execute the alchemist uh inhale the contents control but construction plus for yang buildings add it to the water supply yin buildings and do nothing corruption is minus eight i mean the income is down i mean growth is good right yeah let's 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 add it to the water supply why not Okay, let's do this. Uh, what, what do we have? Let's see, let's recruit a Lizzie Bear. Three of those is probably good. And we're at 16 out of 20. Uh, we need some of these. And that's what we're doing. All right, guys, that is the last turn we're going to do. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Um, we are going to learn a little bit more, and we will be back uh, in the the next one. Uh, where is my original save that I had here? I can't remember what it is. Uh, the last 25 saves will appear on the list. Uh, there should be... Mm, yep, this is fine. Okay, so this is going to be season one. Uh, we don't need the northern provinces. So, we're going to save that. Thank you guys very much for watching the video. We will see you very soon when we come back with the next one.